What are we cooking today, Joyce? I'm making this uni. And uni means a sea urchin. The Japanese word uni. It's an acquired taste. <laughs> but if you start eating it, you will love it. I'm mixing some wasabi sauce. One to one. That's not enough. You might not like it. That's why I make some shrimp. And in case you don't like the uni. Okay. I think you try it eating a particular form of it. No. Making some quinoa. Because it gets the rice some texture. I'm putting half jasmine rice and half Japanese uh, sticky rice. For the quinoa, you need to rinse it. Because always it smells funny. For this dish, you don't like quinoa. Don't put it in. Oh, is it like rice? No, quinoa is another grain. It's all carbs. I don't know, whatever. <laughs> Rinse it like this. I use this water to cook the shrimp in more flavor. Because you have to rinse it for like five minutes. The water is not cloudy anymore. Okay. Then I'm going to transfer into the water when it boils. That's ah, close enough. <laughs> oh, maybe all night. How long do you cook that? Um, until it's sort of like cooked. You can see it. No, you eat it, you mix the rice. I cook the shrimp. I save one. I devangled it. It's better to cook it with the shell. Keep the shrimp in better shape. Or the shrimp will shrink a lot. Mm -hmm. See, oh, I did a good job yeah. devanging it. But sometimes it's not clean. You can rinse it. I wrap it in paper to get rid of the water. Put it back in the, the fridge. You want to do it like almost rice. You can try it. It open up. Now you can buy through. And I'm going to turn it off and cool it down. Mix it with the rice and do the dish. Put the uni on it. It should be like room temperature. It shouldn't be like hot, hot. I like to mix them. See, like this is perfect. I'm not making a lot of them. How's that? <laughs> okay. Let it cool a little bit because I want to put um, fine fish egg in it. To cool it down, you can put a little bit of Japanese vinegar with little sugar. Sugar make everything better. Well, salt and cheese. And salt. Okay, let it scoop out. Now, where can you find that? Any Asian market? I got it in Sunrise Market, which is a Japanese market. I saw it in Chinatown too, but I make pickle and I'm going to use some of that. This is ginger, turnip. I put like a couple of like spicy pepper in it. Okay. I want to cut it smaller. When you smell this, make your mouth water. Really? You don't? You want a piece? Sure. <laughs> you love this kind of pickle stuff. Mmm. Oh, that's good, George. Yeah. You can just eat it like that? You can eat it like that. So this is eggplant. Cut it into smaller. We should make a video of this. What? The pickle? Mm -hmm. This is not flavor, it's just simple seaweed. I want to cut it into smaller. You like seaweed? Yeah. You want to try one piece? Sure. Can you take it yourself? <laughs> uh oh, Kobe didn't take everything. Mm. This is a simple one. I don't, a lot of them now have like oils in it. There's a lot of different flavors now. Yeah, no, but I don't want that. I want the, you know, whatever we make be the stock. I'm going to put a little bit of vinegar with a little sugar. Just a little. A little bit of the you know? Okay. okay. I need to cut this. This is too big. It's always minor detail. Mm -hmm. You can come back after I finish cutting it. And we can put it together. And we can have dinner. <laughs> See, this is cooled down a bit, right? Because you don't want to cook the fine fish egg. It's room temperature. You like fine fish egg, right? Yes. More? Color is nice. <laughs> You're not into color. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> you are into food. You want to taste and see whether... Sure, Joyce. <laughs> <laughs> Who I'm asking? That's rice. Mmm. Tasty, right? Yeah. Tobin <laughs> said that's not enough. <laughs> no, enough for rice. Yeah. Spread it out a little bit and then add pickle all okay. on one side, like this red pickle, and then the other pickle on the other side. There's no wrong way of doing this. It's like a bean bean bar. Yeah, exactly. That's and then seaweed. Smell good already, right? Mm -hmm. and I'm going to put the shrimp on around it. Oh, wow. Just, this is for you. <laughs> well, I will eat it too, but just in case you don't like the uni tail here, tail here, head to head. I saw the Korean, your friend, Shane, and then he said, I never see this much uni in one place. 
I'm not putting so much because you might not like it. How's that? Okay. I'm going to put some seaweed on top of it. And then we can have the sauce. And then the second one, this one I'm going to just put uni in it. Then we have two pictures. Coffin's like, time to eat already. Who cares about pictures? <laughs> when it's time to eat, it's time to eat. Mm -hmm. I don't think you have anything to take home. <laughs> <laughs> it's an acquired taste. Cold, I'm gonna be hopeful. After you try eating this. I want to make the sauce. This is half uh, wasabi and half water, right? I use liquid amino. We can make it with mayonnaise. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Really? Mayonnaise is the magic word. Mayonnaise and cheese. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what is that? I don't want the little dish. Yeah. But that's really spicy though, right, Chris? No, you can dilute it with the cumino. Mm -hmm. You might like that because it's salty. You can adjust it. You don't need to put it in. Okay. So that's for the whole thing or just for the sea urchin? I will use it just for the sea urchin. But now put it on the side. Pick extra time. Extra time.